principles of pre-stressing. Stresses develop in beam due to bending and the applied compressive force. When the beam is subjected to uniformly distributed load, the beam undergoes bending. The concrete regions below the neutral axis undergo tensions, while above the neutral axis undergo compressions. The stress distributed about equally throughout the sections. In the existence of the pre-stressing loop, an axial force is generated within the cross-sectional area of the beam section. Assuming that the concrete is elastic and the principles of superposition apply, the total stress here it will be the summation of the compressive stress plus the bending stress. This means that the stress here it will be the summation of the two compressive stresses, while the total stress here it will be the axial compressive stress minus the stress due to the tensions and that give you a total stress. When the compressive force is applied at an eccentricity from the neutral axis, the member tends to bend upward. This leads to tensions in the top beam while compressions at the bottom beam. The response is opposite to the bending stress generated by the forces. Based on the principle of superpositions, the total stress here is the summation of the stress due to the axial force, bending and eccentricity. This means that the summation of this, this and this will be equal to this, while this and this and this will give you this. The eccentricity offers further advantage when attempting to produce working stress within the required limit.